Hey guys, take a look at the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to erase everything on your iPhone, but keeping your eSIM still available. So this is something you want to do if you want to factory reset your phone, but you still want to have your eSIM service or your cellular service available after you set it up again. So what you'll do is it's going to be really simple. Of course, before you do any of this factory reset, which is going to delete everything on your phone, except the actual SIM card information, you want to make sure you back up your device either through iCloud or through your iTunes app on your computer. But it's important that you back it up because once you delete everything else, it's going to be gone completely. So make sure you do a backup. And if you don't know how to do a backup, I'll leave a link to a video on how to do that. But after you backed up and you're ready to actually do this reset where you're erasing everything but keeping the eSIM, all you do is go into your settings, then you go to general here, and then I'll go all the way down here. It says transfer reset iPhone. You click on that. And then the option that we want to do is erase all content and setting. And once you click on that, you'll be prompted or given this menu. And after you hit continue, so I'll hit continue, continue here. What will happen is it will give you, as you can see here, the option to keep your eSIM and erase your data. Or you can simply choose to delete both the eSIM and erase your data. So this option, most likely the reason why you would do keeping your eSIM is that you're setting up the phone again for yourself or whoever it may be, but you're keeping the information for your eSIM so you don't have to contact your carrier to get that eSIM information activated again. So once you do that, you click on that. And once you click on that, as you can see here, the process just begins just like that. And all you'll do is wait till it completely finishes and goes back to the main screen where it's a hello screen. And this process itself takes about somewhere between a couple minutes or so, but we'll show you when it gets to the actual screen here. Finally, as the process finishes, you should get to this main screen, which means that the erase process completed successfully. However, your eSIM is still available. So once you set it up again, you'll have phone service with your e-service just like that. Now during the process, I recommend making sure your phone doesn't die. So make sure you have enough charge or it's connected to a wall, a charger, and also make sure that it goes through the whole process. Sometimes if you stop the process, it won't go through. But as you can see here, the reason I can say it has phone service is I have 5G here, which means the phone service is still there on the phone, but the data again, if you backed it up, once you backed it up iCloud, you can pretty much restore it from there or from your iTunes. So that's about it. I hope you guys like this video. If so, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching guys. See you guys next time.